Wendell Monroe. On Monday, the Avapai County Board of Supervisors adopted the 2009 Model Food Code, which outlines requirements for potentially hazardous food items. Supervisor Carol Springer voted against the code, which will go into effect at county food establishments in July 2013. The Prescott City Council approved a consolidated court agreement extension Tuesday afternoon. The extension, which is for one year, allows the city and Yavapai County to continue to share court services. The Board of Supervisors is scheduled to consider the extension on July 2nd. On Wednesday night, the Century Yavapai Metropolitan Planning Organization Executive Board approved an interim regional transportation plan update. The short-term update will address immediate highway needs, including the widening of Highway 89 in the Prescott Airport area, a design concept report for Great Western Drive in Prescott Valley, and completion of the Williamson Valley Road design from Pioneer Parkway to Outer Loop Road. The Prescott Valley Town Council discussed adjustments to water and sewer rates Thursday night. Customer Accounts Manager Cordell Compton explained no increases are being proposed for water users. A $0.06 increase per 1,000 gallons of monthly water usage is being proposed for sewer customers. The City of Prescott announced there had been four layoffs in the Community Development, Tourism and Risk Departments, as well as in the City Manager's Office. Officials stated this round of layoffs brings the total number of city employees to leave their jobs since March to 38. On Tuesday afternoon, the Prescott City Council appointed Eugene Neal Interim City Attorney. Neal, who has served as Yavapai County Attorney and Sedona Assistant Attorney, currently works as a part-time senior associate at a local law firm. He starts on July 9th, three days after Attorney Gary Kidd retires. Charges against seven men allegedly involved in an August 21, 2010 shootout between the Hells Angels and Vagos motorcycle gangs in Chino Valley were dropped Tuesday. It was argued in Yavapai County Superior Court that the two grand juries who prosecuted the Hells Angels members were never told witness Alfred Ezevada was a paid informant. Judge Soleil Hancock dismissed the charges, stating the prosecution violated the men's rights. And it was announced the Yavapai Prescott Indian Tribe would be taking over as owners and operators of the 684,000 square foot Frontier Village Shopping Center on Highway 69 in Prescott. An agreement was reached following meetings between the tribe and the Phoenix-based Grace Investments. I'm Bill Monroe and that's your KQ&A News Week in Review.